Israel carries out strikes on Gaza after rocket fire resumes for residents of Gaza and southern Israel, the fleeting period of calm is over. The Israeli military said it carried out strikes on militant targets in Gaza on Friday in response to a barrage of rocket fire after a three-day truce in the region came to an end without a longer-term agreement. At least 50 rockets were fired at Israel after the ceasefire expired Friday morning, the Israel Defense Forces said. Most of the rockets hit unpopulated areas, but one injured a civilian and slightly injured a soldier, the IDF said. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu and Defense Minister Moshe Yalon ordered the military to respond forcefully to the resumption in rocket fire, Israeli officials said. The IDF said it targeted terror sites across the Gaza Strip. Several explosions were heard in Gaza City, as Israeli fighter jets flew overhead. Local media reported airstrikes elsewhere in the territory. One strike in Gaza City killed a 10-year-old boy, said Ashraf el a spokesman for the Palestinian Ministry of Health. Hamas, the Islamic militant group that holds power in Gaza, said that Palestinian officials at peace talks in Cairo hadn't agreed to extend the truce but would continue negotiations. But Israeli government spokesman Mark Rejev told CNN, that the resumption of rocket fire means Hamas has broken the fundamental premise of the talks in Cairo. The Israeli delegation arrived back from Egypt about an hour, before the ceasefire ended, Israeli officials said. Israel says truce violated Israel, which pulled its ground forces out of Gaza earlier this week, had said Thursday it was willing to extend the truce unconditionally. Two militant factions Islamic Jihad and the Al Nasser Salah al Din brigades who have fought alongside Hamas in Gaza under the banner of the resistance said they had fired rockets at Israel on Friday. The enemy ended the ceasefire, when he refused to accept the demands of the resistance and he bears responsibility for the consequences of that, the military wing of Islamic Jihad said in a statement. Roughly three hours, before the truce was due to end, the IDF said two rockets fired from Gaza had hit southern Israel, without causing any casualties. Terrorists have violated the ceasefire, the IDF wrote on Twitter. It was unclear who in Gaza, where multiple militant factions are active, launched the two rockets, which landed near Eshkel in southern Israel.